Ever notice how the modern combat helmet looks a lot like the German Stahlhelm from World War II? Well, let's talk about it. So as you can see, the shapes are very similar. Back in World War I, it was actually viewed as cowardly to wear a helmet, so they were wearing soft caps. However, shrapnel casualties became a really big concern. While the Germans did start with the Pickelhalbe, the spiky helmet that you see in World War I, they came around with a version of this in 1916, known as the Stahlhelm, like this one. So the reason that this one was the best design in that time period was simply because of the shape. You have wide brims to protect your neck and the back of your head from shrapnel coming down on you. The reason that the shape was selected later on down the line, in terms of modern use, had a lot more to do with your ability to use your peripheral vision and have maximum protection to your neck and face. This was just simply a better design than the US M1 helmet, and that's why it went to this when we started doing Kevlar. This being the most modern iteration, this was my helmet, and you can still see the similarities. 